Hi, welcome back to Stampy's Random Reviews and Tutorials. In this video, I'm going to show you how to reset the change oil soon message that you get on the console when you're driving. It's really annoying. Just a note, this isn't the oil service required notification that you get coming up. If you need to reset that, take a look at this card in the top right hand corner. This is particularly for the change oil soon warning that you get on the dashboard that you can't get rid of it's really annoying this is a 19 plate focus I also have a 17 plate focus and um, the system of getting rid of this is slightly different there's a few different ways to do it but by the end of this video whichever car you've got whichever year you've got whatever Ford vehicle you've got I'm going to show you all the different ways to do it so by the end of the video you will have rid of that change oil soon warning on your dashboard so stick with us till the end because I am going to cover everything you need to know and don't forget leave me a comment at the end of the video thank you okay so a few different ways to do this don't worry I am going to help you get rid of this one thing I want to say first up is if you do need to change the oil of course change the oil so as you can see I've now cleared this light off here it was annoying me every time I drove the car change oil soon change oil soon change oil soon really annoying couldn't get rid of it doesn't need changing so I couldn't find a way to reset this now the standard Ford way of doing this would be to turn your key on two positions so around here you can go twice and don't start the engine then what you would do is you would hold the brake and accelerate it now I'm sure you've heard this before if you've done some research on the internet but unfortunately that doesn't seem to clear the change oil soon light if it doesn't I'm going to come back to the pedal situation in a minute if it doesn't stick with me because I'm going to show you something on this console first and then I'm going to show you how to do it using the pedals so if you can't find it a way of doing it using these pedals and holding them down with the key in position too you're gonna to have to go through these menu settings in here so you can use this hamburger menu to open these settings up here and it'll take you through all the different things and to go back you press this one so I'm gonna go down here using this I'm gonna to go to vehicle settings is what I'm looking for so under settings I'm gonna click the OK button on some versions of these cars there are different ways to reset this so once I'm in there use this hamburger menu and you can scroll down here go to vehicle settings and you'll see all these different things in different menus now in some cars there is actually an oil warning reset button and on my car no matter which menu I've been into it doesn't exist so all this is a bit confusing and things have changed on these newer Ford models but the way to get rid of this if you can't reset it on this console here what you would do is you would go back to the original method of turning the key so turning the key two clicks you don't need to start the engine and then hold the brake and accelerator but hold them for 30 seconds um, if you don't hold it for 30 seconds this won't work and what happens then is you do not get a confirmation on the dashboard saying that it's been reset on the older models such as the 17 plate you will get a warning coming up saying this oil system's now been reset thank you very much and you can walk away on this model on the 19 plate cars there is no notification however if you do the two clicks on the key hold the accelerator and brake for 30 seconds and then release the pedals turn the car off the next time you drive the car the warning has actually disappeared for the change oil soon so just because you don't get a notification saying that it hasn't been reset you'll find that it actually has so it could have caught you out and again have a look through these menus within these systems and just make sure if you're especially if you're in america they have all different things in these settings and you can sometimes get down to these things and reset them from there if this helps you on one of the newer Fords on the Mark IVs please leave me a comment and click like because there's so many people struggling with this and I reply to all the comments I get on this video as well get in the car turn the key two clicks hold the brake and accelerate for 30 seconds you will not see a warning notification or anything come up on the dashboard restart the car after a minute or so and drive away most importantly if you do need to change the oil of course change the oil so there'll be a card now in the end of this video where it will take you to the 17 plate version of doing this where it shows you the notification as well and also a car 
a card here showing you how to get thick snow foam with cartridge pressure washer. Thanks for watching. Leave me a comment. It's bad karma if you don't.